Hey, welcome back everybody. We have another TTM video today. Don't forget about the 900 subscriber video we posted yesterday. Uh, go ahead and go over there, leave a comment, post it to your social media accounts to get extra entries. And I'll leave a link probably to that uh, video at the end of this video. But first we got autographs TTM through the mail. We've got eight to get to, so let's get right to it. We've got a little bonus got one from kansas city and then we have another from kansas city mr art still we'll save that to last he sent us an extra envelope <laughs> february 12th when still using the santa claus stamps that's pretty cool and then of course we have his regular kansas city return hopefully we just sent to him uh very recently but the first one is from metroplex michigan they're using the old school and it took a long time to get here. And the envelope is where for the worse. Worried about this one. Metroplex, Michigan, first up. Little rippage here. First one, we get autographs. Oh boy. The Lem Barney rookie card. Heavily dinged. He didn't use the um, index cards, and this is a stamp. This is a stamp. You can see there in the ink of the Y. Probably a stamp made for an 8x10. That's why it doesn't fit properly on the card. I don't know if he tried to... That's just a double image where he pushed down and rolled the stamp or he tried to trace it afterwards. I don't know. That's very depressing. $15. $15 for a stamp. And because the index cards weren't put back in there, the card got damaged by the postal service. Man, that is depressing. Why would... Just don't stamp it. I mean, don't just return it. We've heard he's in... Poor health, questionable return since last June, so took a gamble. But again, 38 days on the return for the stamp, so shouldn't have sent that one. Brockton, Massachusetts, let's hope we have some better ones in the next seven. Brockton, Mass, Joe Nash. That's pretty cool. Got my game day card signed. Didn't do the index cards. He put them in there, though. That's what protects... The card on the mail back. Joe Nash, big fella. Played out of Boston College and played for a long time for the Seahawks. He is 61 years old. Played defensive tackle forever. 15 seasons. Let's put these right there. 82 to 96. Had 48 sacks as a defensive tackle nose guard. That's pretty good. Pro Bowl appearance. In 1984, and that was good enough to land him on a spot in the Seahawks' 35th anniversary team. So he's a legend in Seattle. 21, 22 days, no fee. And as always, I'll have this down in the description below. I'll have the names of everybody I got returned, how long it took, and whether there's a fee or not. I do that in all my videos, so be sure to check that out if you have any questions afterwards. Tampa, St. Pete, up next. Oh, I'm still looking at that stamp. So weak. Hey, Tim McCarver. A little strength in the game up there. Nice, clear signature on that for the Hall of Famer on the 62 tops. He's 80 years old. Second time we've received him on the 62 tops rookie. Looks great. I've Got the first one off to PSA to get slabbed. Seems like I see that in every video now. I got the card off to PSA to get slabbed. Well, I've got five with Brandon Stebbins with um, Beckett waiting for those to come back. And I've got 22 cards with um, Garrett over at Slab City, better known on YouTube as Card Cutter. Uh, but I've got 22 cards with him. So 27 cards all together. So very likely you're going to see repeats. And that's... I've got that one out. That might be a better signature than my other card. Although I think my other card was in a little bit better condition, if that means anything. That's a sweet signature from the Hall of Famer. $10 a piece for Tim McCarver. 
And I got that back in uh, 12 days. Hall of Fame uh, broadcaster. Tulsa, Oklahoma. Tulsa, Oklahoma. Steve Rogers, Captain America. Very nice. I've seen some other people get him back. I was hoping not to get him back. They've been out for a long time. He's 72 years old, as you can see, a right-handed pitcher. Really a quality pitcher, too, for a long time. He played from 73 to 85, and he played all his career with one team, the Montreal Expos. Take a look at that Diamond King. Pretty sweet. Led the league in ERA in 1982, five times an All-Star. Who knew that? This has been out a while. In fact, I was just looking. I saw both Expos pitchers, Steve Rogers and Steve Renko, the two Steves, been out for a long time. Now, Rogers came back, let's see, 100. 130, 150, 154 days for Steve Rogers and Steve Renko's two out. No fee for the five-time All-Star. 154 days, no fee. Kansas City Mo Got two of them from Kansas City today. This is the first one from Kansas City. And that is Joe Carter. Ooh, a little smudge on the end of his signature there. Second time I've gotten this card back, 84 Donruss. This is one of the cards I actually thought about sending off to get slabbed. Maybe I will in some future date. Oops, let's get that focused in there. There you go. Look at that. Clean. 84 Donner is kind of an iconic card. Joe Carter's rookie. Nice. Another guy. I send only one card at a time for Joe Carter. It seems like if you send more than one, he kind of messes it up. So one card and $5 fee for Joe Carter. Mr. Walkoff. Game six for his. Game seven for Bill Mazeroski. How long did that take for Joe Carter? Just 15 days for him. $5 a fee. And just send one at a time for him. North Dallas. North Texas. Dallas, Texas, I should say. Kind of stuck in there. Joe Ferguson on his rookie. 74 tops rookie. And that 80, look at those stats. Really good quarterback for a long time. 3,572 yards and 79. That was his best season, probably. 74 is tops as his rookie. Didn't sign the index cards. Have to see if we sent two. I think we sent two. Joe Carter and then Joe Ferguson. 71 years old. He played for 18 seasons, 73 to 90. 12 of them for the Bills. Led the NFL in TDs in 75 and passing yards in 77, 2803. Touchdowns in 75 with 25. Pretty cool. Bill's Wall of Fame. Got that back very quickly. 10 days, no fee. 10 days, no fee. He changed his address about six, seven months ago, I think. Miami, Florida up next. Miami, Florida up next. Taped up the envelope. He taped it up where I can't even get it open. Let's see here. Here, I'll give us a little start. Who is it? Oh, to be Young Again McDowell, John 316. 91 Upper Deck, 91 Ultra, and the 85 Tops, which he personalized. Wish he didn't personalize that one. Like those Olympic cards a lot, those 85 tops. 59 years old. He played center field. He was on that 84 Olympic team. On the silver medal, believe it or not. Then he played for the uh, Rangers, and Indians, and Braves. He doesn't sign Indians cards as far as I could tell. He returns those unsigned. Just played with them very, very briefly for not even half a season, I think, in 89. 10 days, no fee. For Odeb McDowell, the top prospect coming out of college, Golden Spikes Award winner, ten days no fee. Okay, here's the one from Kansas City, from Art Still. We believe it's got to be right. Open the cards first. Yeah, eighty-nine pro set, eighty-five tops with the Chiefs. Notice he changed his number, sixty-seven and seventy-two there. Art still 67, 72. KCC, 72 bills. Yeah, he even noticed it. <laughs> That's really neat. 
He was a great player as well. He had 49 sacks himself, much like Joe Nash. 48 and a half and 49. That's decent. All-American at Kentucky and was the second overall pick. And uh, College Football Hall of Famer in 2015 for his work at Kentucky. He was four times in the Pro Bowl. Played for 12 seasons, 78 to 89. And uh, Chiefs and Bills. So let's see what he's got in the envelope. This should be good. Art Stew. How long did that take? 11 days. 11 days, no fee. Art Stew. You're Michael. Looks like he signed the letter as well. In the light of your search, and do to hope love you well. It's always refreshing. Respect the Bible. My name is Art Still. Ooh. Jeremiah 29, 6, 29, 11. Looks like he wrote a brochure. And you can obtain a free copy by reaching out to me by mail or email. That's his email if you want a free copy of that. That's pretty cool. And he signed it. Really neat. Mr. Still went out of his way for that one. I appreciate that. Well, that's it. Thank you, Mr. Still. Believing in my life eternal. All right. So again, I'll leave a link to the 900 subscriber giveaway, which uh, we posted yesterday evening. Sorry, this one's running a little bit late tonight. I usually re release them in the afternoon, but you had to wait till Thursday evening to see this one. So we had one, two, three. I'm going to count seven returns and the uh, Bummer Lim Barney stamp for $15 and damaged rookie card. Oh, boy. But we got Tim McCarver. We got Joe Carter. We got a great letter from Art Still. We got Joe Ferguson on his rookie. A lot of great returns. So let me know down below what your favorite was. Always give thumbs up and uh, tell me you liked the video and what did you like the best. And if you haven't subscribed yet, the one requirement to be a part of my 900 subscriber giveaway is to be a subscriber. So give that click right there. And then if you ring that bell, you'll be notified of all my future videos. Again, thanks for being with me today and we will see you soon.